On June the 30th, K-pop fans were surprised when the popular name Gain Brown Eyed Girls was arrested for being involved in narcotic drug use. The female idol must pay a fine of 1 million Korean won, about $884, for violating Korea's Narcotics Control Act. According to the company, during her activities, Gain accumulated both small and large injuries and wounds. She has been suffering from severe pains, depression, and sleep disorders for a long time, and during that process, made a reckless decision. Cut in the scandal of narcotic drug use, fans can't help regretting for Grain, an extremely prominent female idol not strained to the second-generation K-pop. She is the youngest member of the brown-eyed girls group, once famous for a while with the hit Abracadabra. The song once dominated digital music charts, bringing the groups a series of awards in 2009. Reminiscing about the heyday, Abracadabra was a song with the most prominent choreography and EDM color. The song itself is a turnaround to bring the career record of brown-eyed girls to the peak. Not only possessing an addictively spell-like melody, Abracadabra also has a highlight hip-shake choreography that is loved by both fans and idols, still often covering even though it was released more than 10 years ago. Not only succeeding with brown-eyed girls, Gain also achieved herself an impressive solo record. Current K-pop fans often think of Hyunae when it comes to sexy legends. However, many years ago, Gain was also an equally prominent name pursuing this concept. Right from the time of her debut, Gain had a hit named Bloom. The song, as soon as released, peaked at number one on the Gaon music chart and at number two on the Billboard Korean chart. Bloom not only won trophies at weekly music stages, but also won the Song of the Year award at the Gaon chart K-pop awards. Sexy exploded through each of Gain's comeback works. Paradise Lost was literally a work of her that truly reached the top of glamour and sensuality. The song once again helped Gain strengthen on the K-pop solo race with her personal color. <laughs> She also became a hot name when participating in the We Got Married with 2PM member Joe Kwan. The couple was considered one of the strongest ships in the show. Then the two released a collaboration song called We Fell In Love Together, won a series of trophies at the weekend music show and won the Best Collaboration Award at MAMA 2009. In 2013, Gain starred in size billion view MV Gentleman, continuing her popularity. However, it is Gain's outstanding solo activities that have caused her group's popularity drop in K-pop. Not until 2019 could brown-eyed girls officially come back after four years in a new album called Revive. Gain apologized for the delay in Brown Eyed Girls' comeback. It's because of me that the group has to stop working together for four years because I need to have time for myself. We originally planned to come back after two years, but because of me, we have to postpone it to another two years. I sincerely apologize, and in the future, I will definitely work harder. But since the comeback in 2019, Gain has almost disappeared from the K-pop market. Until the scandal related to banned substances was revealed, the fans partially understood the problem and bitterly regretted that gains one successful career.